probably been 20 years or since there was last water in this ditch or ran in the backside of the property here. And because of a broken culvert up at the canal, we never got water in here for that 25 years. And when they redid the roadway to do a roundabout here, they fixed that culvert too because we got some new neighbors who were paying $80 a year to have water for irrigation. I don't use it. We had to get everything back into, I guess, proper water flow through the neighbors here that goes into a covert underneath the road. It took a good amount of time. Oh, look at that. We have a gopher. And we have dirt here. Well, I need to get my gopher traps out. This very old water pipe ditch canal area, I need to clean out. Um, yeah. we need to clean it out. There hasn't been water. Well, there's water in that ditch last year because they just fixed the covert. There has been water in this ditch for 20 plus years. But I need to get it fixed. So it's gonna be a project and a half. So while I'm doing that, getting my burn pile. And we have that burning, so it's just clean and burn. Clean and burn. Yep, you're on the four row row? Yeah. Can you say four row 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 or? The four row row. All right, I'm gonna say I'm probably at this tree right here. Got all the rest of that to do. The hard, harder area to do. To clean up back here. Um, I did the easy stuff because that's pretty much taken care of a little bit in the past. I've tried to spray this up, but this area over here just overgrown. And yeah, I need to get it all cleaned up. Um, as I'm going, I'm just burning as I go, uh, cleaning up around it after the middle falls in. It's a start. Uh, water will be coming through that area right there. Probably need to go a little bit wider, build up the sides more, but it's a start. All right, day two on the ditch project. As you see, I kind of got this started, but after thinking about it, I'm going to need to go probably three spades of a shovel wide, about a spade deep. That's how much I'll probably go on it. Keep going at this end because that's where the water is going to come in and it's going to flow all the way down to you'll there's a spot underneath the fence under there. My neighbor's side I'm just going to show you a little bit. You guys chickens right here but he has his tractor and he just kind of graded it down to this point right by the fence. So I'm actually going to start going up under his fence as you see he needs to keep going too to go under the fence here so we can go down the back here because if we don't get this done 
It is a misdemeanor for not taking care of a uh, irrigation ditch. It runs on your property. It's like a water rights misdemeanor or something because we're not allowing the neighbors to get the full flow of water that is they deserve too. Alright, just got done eating dinner, took a break from digging the ditch, so I'm just showing you where I ended up for the night. It is uh, not really much of a, it is, it's more of a I am worn out. It's been a big project, but as like you see, I'm about... I'm gonna say probably, probably gonna butcher this, but it looks about 30, uh, 30 yards or so from the property line right there where it goes underneath the fence to where the ditch is coming through. We'll go from that, we'll see what it looks like tomorrow after work. Unfortunately, my weekend is over. I miss my three day weekends, what I used to get, but too bad the company doesn't, didn't want to pay the benefits that I need for the family. I've never felt so alive in my life. Cause you make. Anyways, ditch project is done. Wanted to say thank you for to mom, dad for coming from the East Coast to knock this project out get some of this more stuff cleaned up. The boys for helping me shovel a bunch of stuff up, the wife. And uh, just remember to like, subscribe, and check out the next video. And always to live a fulfilling life. Free comes life every time. I'm free.